All right, so uh, we have one of the greatest uh, non-official uh, ad uh, advisors or executive producer, whatever you want to call them, uh, giving me some great information here. So let's uh, let's get right to it, okay? Bank of America is now offering zero down payment. That's zero, zero mortgages, payment mortgages in certain black and Hispanic neighborhoods. And they're offering zero down payment mortgages with no closing cost for the first time homeowners in certain black and Hispanic uh, neighborhoods. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that great? And let me see. There's anything else I want to talk about? Well, besides the fact that it's racial discrimination against the white man and the white woman and the hardworking white man and the hardworking white woman, isn't this amazing? And then I commented to my boy that, yes, everything is black and Spanish in America today. It's all about the brown man and the black man but it's more about the black man than the brown man. You see? And uh, I'll, I'll, uh, I'm going to address that. Uh, actually, I want to address the second thing, and then I'll address as, as it goes. Also, they have shipped about 6,000 more illegal aliens to Chicago because they're doing it to all the satur you know, uh, not sat Well, the cities are going to be saturated. Sanctuary cities. Um... But there's still like 3 million more in Texas. Now, you liberals out there, you libtards out there, you stupid motherfuckers. Do you understand what 3 million additional people are to this country and how it's going to put a tremendous amount of resource, resources and everything? Where are we going to put 3 million people Mostly illegal aliens. No, not mostly. All of them illegal aliens. Now, I wonder if the Biden administration thought about that. Because, as I said in my other videos, and this is from what I heard, not what I'm saying. That the Democrats want to flood our country with illegal aliens so they can get voted in on every election. And the process is already happening because you're already giving illegal aliens driver's licenses for nothing for free you don't have to earn a driver's license anymore i know i earn mine right and everything i have i got to pay for i'm not like the government giving these people ten thousand dollar visa debit cards and and uh you know apartments and clothes and radios and food and electronics and anything they want the federal government has become the i dream of genie government wish upon my 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 bottle master and i will give you what you want so it is the, it is racial discrimination it is the abomination of the white population here in this country the white man and the white woman are going to be overrun by Muslims, Orientals, black and brown people. Okay? I can't think of anything else and everything else in between. Uh, in that situation, I would like to know if they could send my uh, retirement uh, check to um, a place like Ireland or United Kingdom, even though they have their problems there. Nothing compared to the United States because the, uh, the discrimination here in America for the white people is at an astronomical high. I have never seen it this bad ever. And ladies and gentlemen, we're heading for a Armageddon future where white people are going to be destroyed. And for political reasons or... Well, it's got to be for political. It can't be because the government hates white people. You know, everything that the 
government does, including the this this thing about the new world order and the the free Freemasons and you know tunnels and tremendous tunnels and everything underground in Denver Airport and the mosaic uh, writings which lead to something very sinister, uh, 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 a message that we're all going to be in trouble. I I hope that the vaccine that I took is not going to kill me. And uh, I'm very scared right now. But, uh, you know, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, Okay, so let's talk about uh, the other subject here, if you don't mind. Hold on a second. Um, Yeah, I want to put this on pause. Hold on. Okay, sorry, I had to read a uh, uh, a message from whatever. Um, so the next item here uh, is um, okay. Is that it? Oh, that they shipped uh, about six thousand more illegals to Chicago, but there's still three million more. Look, all I know is that. This is insanity what's going on. Our own government is 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 almost like turning against regular Americans, the people who've been here, the people who made this country great, and now we're being sold down the river to a bunch of millions and millions of like illegal aliens that are going to take over jobs and they're going to take over you we just look it's not just jobs but it's going to be other things i don't know what they are you would know better than i would and i just want to know one thing about ratso fatso Uh uh-huh i want to know about ratso fatso um hold on a second like I said, what does Ratso Fatso think about sending millions and millions and millions that fucking libtard, that leftist liberal douchebag and his fucking jerk-off boyfriends over there in New Hampshire and, and anywhere where you get this uh, a podcast. No, it's not a podcast. It's the Crazy Joe Show Video Chronicles. Come on, Matt. Say something. Let me know when you're going to say something. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to call your show. Say something on here. What do you think of all these goddamn motherfucking illegal aliens coming into our country, invading our country to take over? Oh, you think just because you live in 98.9% fucking white New Hampshire, it's not going to happen to you. They're going to, oh, I get it. They're going to ship them to New York City, Chicago, Dallas, LA, everywhere else in between. Well, you know what, Ratso? I hope about a fucking million illegal aliens coming to your fucking state. And we're going to see how white your state is going to become. 